for 2022, the Honda Passport has received a mid-cycle refresh. I think you know how this is gonna play out. First, we'll hit you up with that mid-cycle refresh graphic. There we go. And then I'll explain that the refreshed exterior styling is more aggressive. Let's see, there's a new rear bumper and updated exhaust finishers. Then up front, everything forward of the A-pillar has been aggressified. And while aggressified isn't actually a word, I think you know what I mean. Come on, look at that power bulge hood, revised front fenders, and blockier nose. Add in the new grill crossbar and what Honda calls a skid garnish, and yeah, the Passport went and got itself aggressified. So far, this all feels fairly predictable. But did you predict this? That's called drama. Drama, people. This 2022 Honda Passport happens to be the new Trail Sport trim. Trail Sport being a new series for Honda's light truck offerings. Further down the road, the Trail Sport line might include real functional upgrades like gnarlier off-road tires and suspension options. For now though, the Passport Trail Sport is mostly an appearance package. Does your Passport have orange badging, a more aggressive bumper, and pewter wheels, although I recognize these are black accessory wheels? If so, you might be driving a Trail Sport. Observant viewers might note that Honda has enhanced this particular Trail Sport with aftermarket modifications. It's got a 1.5 inch lift, Firestone all-terrain tires, prototype orange front recovery hooks, and that rooftop tent definitely is not stock. Consider this an expression of what an owner could do if they bought a refreshed Passport. And for the sake of comparison, here's what the 2022 Passport refresh looks like, minus all the aftermarket add-ons. Inside, the Passport Trail Sport is distinguished by orange stitching and logos on the headrest to remind you which Passport you bought. The Trail Sport also includes standard power folding mirrors for narrower trails, plus a heated windshield wiper pad for frosty adventures. That said, aside from a 10 millimeter wider track, the 2022 Honda Passport Trail Sport offers no notable off-road advantages versus any other all-wheel drive Passport. As a reminder, Honda's torque vectoring alphanumeric explosion of an all-wheel drive system, dubbed IVTM4, can send up to 70% of the engine's power to the rear tires, and from there, actively apportion up to 100% of that power to either the left or right rear tire. Speaking of power, the 3.5 liter V6's output remains unchanged for 2022. And like the 2021 Passport, transmission duties are still handled by a nine-speed automatic transmission. Inside, updates for 2022 are minimal. These uh, gauge needles are now white, and there's now a new rear seat passenger reminder so you don't forget your uh, wife, kids, or household pets. Honda won't release 2022 pricing until closer to its on-sale date near the end of 2021, but the current version starts just under $33,000, not including destination charges. Where pricing is concerned, I'm not expecting a major bump for 2022. I also wouldn't expect hardcore off-roaders to abandon their Jeeps, Broncos, and Forerunners for a trail sport, but I am excited for Honda to explore its rugged side. Honda, if you're taking requests, I would love a passport that I can jump. <laughs>